We are currently at Loveland Airfield, and I'm about to go for a ride in that. Oh, I hope I don't throw up. So I know what you're thinking, why would anyone want to put a YouTuber in a jet? Well, they pick people that have had influence on the community and whatnot, and we've done a bunch of fundraisers and stuff for different charities. Most recently, we raised $14,000 for Alex's Lemonade Stand, a nonprofit that raises money for children's cancer research. I have no idea what I'm doing right now. I didn't even know if I wanted to do this, but I knew I wasn't gonna say no. Apparently, it goes 1,200 miles per hour. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> he went straight up. Wow, you can feel the, your entire body when it comes by. Uh, today, you'll pretty much hit the sound barrier. I was a break this number, and this is being the amount of G's that you guys pull. It's very heavy. It's just like you're getting pulled in. You feel your face kind of kind of suck back a little bit. Your cheeks kind of pull down a little bit. Because when you're pulling high G's, blood is going to your lower extremities, and we need that blood to come to your brain. If your brain doesn't have oxygen, you go night night. So you're gonna go here, eject, eject, eject. The third eject, you're gonna go up. You deploy. When you see the camp deploy, you're gonna see these red handles. Ready, hit. <laughs> All right, it's go time. I also just found out that the ride is 45 minutes long. 45 minutes in a jet. We could go to Canada and back like twice. High performance climb on takeoff, okay? Sounds good, let's send it. Would this be a good time to tell you I threw up on the tilt a whirl? Assess how our body's gonna respond to G-forces today, okay? All right. There's two G's, nothing too crazy. A little pull. There's three and a half, pull it down. Here comes four. There's four right there. You're doing great. Pure nose high. Six G's. Nice. Oh, I'm really warm. You gotta okay. give me a minute. I, I am feeling woozy. I was gonna do a wrap up at the airfield, but honestly, I was so out of it, I could barely function. Heidi drove me home and I literally went to bed at five o'clock. But I do wanna say a huge thank you to the entire Blue Angels crew. Even though I got sick, it was still amazing and truly the ride of a lifetime. And I also wanna give a huge shout out to all of our service men and women, especially those flying jets. I don't know how you do what you do. Make sure to kick those tires too. Check that. That's pretty slick. That's pretty slick. Yeah. That's pretty slick.